All right, let's talk about the weekend forecast breezy, but at least the temperatures are going to be going up. We're back in the upper 40s both Saturday and Sunday. Really the only issue this weekend is going to be the wind gusting up to 30 35 miles per hour at times. Patchy rain possible at least for the first half on Sunday with a front that's going to make for a very cold Monday wind chill forecast on Monday coming up in just a second out there tonight though. We're in the mid 30s. We're overcast right now. We have these mid level clouds coming in from the west and if we broaden out the view, there's a little bit of moisture right now sitting over central Iowa as that gets closer to us. It's going to dry up, but I can't rule out a sprinkle even a flurry early tomorrow morning, but not that big of a chance on Sunday though. It's a one two punch. First a front comes in in the morning. That's going to kick up the wind brings us some cooler air and then the real cold stuff coming out of Canada comes in late Sunday and that's why we're going to be so cold on Monday. Now tomorrow morning we're in the 30s right around the freezing mark in many spots and again a sprinkle or flurry possible wind chills in the low 30s. And in the afternoon, at least some peaks of sunshine. We'll call it partly cloudy. High temperatures, milder than it has been the last two days, upper 40s and low 50s. Then on Sunday, a little bit of light rain. You'll see a few sprinkles, maybe a little bit of drizzle in the morning, and that could pick up a bit in the afternoon. 30s in the morning on Sunday. High temperatures will make it into the upper 40s and low 50s. And notice we clear out a bit, but the wind will be strong out of the west northwest, 35, potentially up to 40 miles per hour, and that's transporting that real cold air. Monday 20s in the morning, but get this the wind chills Monday morning single digits could be as cold as five degrees in some spots. We make it into the low 30s for Monday afternoon, but still it's going to be windy on Monday. So we're looking at wind chills Monday afternoon 15 to 22 degrees and temperatures modify at least a little bit on Tuesday, but we're still in the 30s upper 30s, mostly sunny. Suddenly winds get us back in the 40s on Wednesday passing shower possible on Wednesday. And then what about next Thursday? Thanksgiving 44. We're going to go mostly cloudy, breezy to windy conditions, and we can't rule out a sprinkle embedded in this thick cloud cover. But at this point for Thursday for Thanksgiving, it's a pretty small chance at 10%. So in the overnight, the clouds are with us, mainly dry other than a sprinkle or again a flurry first thing in the morning. We'll be at 33 in the overnight, but the temperatures will go up to about 37 degrees by the time we head towards 6 a.m. Stuck in the clouds first half of the day, and then some peaks of sunshine mixed in with those clouds in the afternoon and high temperatures about seven to eight degrees warmer than the last two days. 49 degrees on Sunday, some patchy areas of light rain possible, rain chance at 20% and then some clearing in the afternoon. It's just windy and then cold on Monday, 22 to start the day, 32 in the afternoon, wind chills in the teens, mostly sunny 38 on Tuesday, slight chance of rain 45 on Wednesday and again Thanksgiving Day, Thursday 44 with about a 10% chance just to count for a few sprinkles. Erica and Brad. All right, not too bad on our Thanksgiving. Thank you, Albert.